What's up guys, good morning. I almost didn't vlog today. Actually, I told myself I wasn't going to because I'm still playing catch up on editing from just like a few times where I've like gotten um, behind schedule. So I was gonna play catch up and just like have a day. I have to get some cleaning done anyway, so I thought it was just gonna be a boring day. But the girls are having so much fun outside that it almost feels wrong not to vlog. I'm running some warm water for their little kiddie pool. They originally asked me if they could go outside and swing, and so I was taking a break from cleaning to go and just like push them on the swing and stuff. And then I got really, really hot, so I decided to fill up the kiddie pool. I'm in my swimsuit, so I think I'm gonna get in too. But I am just grabbing a few like big tumblers of really hot water to add to the cold water because the water from the hose is just like extremely cold and it is hot out there but it ain't that hot okay that didn't do much at all so let me see if i have anything a little bit bigger just thought i'd do the trick Don't want it to get too heavy. Oh. <laughs> That's a bit heavy. is dying like actively dying so I'm gonna put my camera up and I'll catch you guys in a little bit no. why are you telling me no uh. baby are you eating pudding no. you need mama wipe your face <gasps> oh now you're being nasty now you're just being nasty are you gonna get pudding on that clean swimsuit you got pudding all over your face, ma'am. You got pudding all over your face. Yeah. Hey! Oh, that girl is a sass master. So, two of my main cravings lately with this pregnancy have been toasted Pop-Tarts, strawberry Pop-Tarts, and cereal. And I know that's not the best, but that has been like staples of my diet lately. <laughs> that's horrible. Also, I just saw Henley scoop pudding off of her shirt with a spoon and eat it. And I'm just like so proud right now. So if you watched yesterday's vlog, you know that we kind of like rescued a dog yesterday. He's like super sweet, super sweet dog. We gave him a bath. We took him to the vet to see if he was microchipped and he wasn't. No collar, nothing. And he's like really, really hungry too, like really hungry. We really, really like him and like honestly, he would be a really good fit for the family, but the bottom line is we just can't afford another dog. I feel like we're always taking in pets and like strays just find us. Like he's like the fourth stray to just like show up on our porch. I'm not even kidding. Or for us to find on the side of the road. We found some dogs on the side of the road. And I guess we're those type of people that just like pick up dogs off the side of the road, but we just can't afford a, a dog and a newborn right now. It's just like doesn't make sense. So, Trey took him to work with him today. He's gonna try to get someone to take him in because we haven't gotten any messages from anybody and I don't really expect that we're going to get any messages, honestly. So hopefully somebody wants him and we can rehome him. By the way, if you're local and you're looking for a dog, <laughs> if I still have him, let me know. I also wanna note that I'm just like really happy today. Like I'm having like a really good day, honestly. And I feel terrible, like, I am like almost 36 weeks pregnant and I feel like it, like I feel super tired. I'm in a lot of pain, but I'm just like really happy. And this entire time I've been vlogging in like the worst light, 
I could have been vlogging like this and I would have looked so much better. The next day. What you got? Are you doing makeup? Is that mommy's makeup? You, you love it? But. On my face? Here, are you gonna do my face? Mm, thank you. It's so pretty. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. Yesterday just got like real chill and kind of boring. Like we really didn't do anything yesterday. So I decided to combine yesterday's video with today's video since I was really worried about kind of um, like lightening my workload as I was talking about yesterday. So we're just gonna combine these two videos. I did not get all the cleaning done yesterday that I really wanted to get done, but today cannot be a cleaning day. Tomorrow is Zoe's birthday. Well, not her birthday, her birthday party. We are gonna celebrate her birthday tomorrow and I have nothing done. There is a dog video bombing me right now. I don't have decorations, I don't have balloons, I don't have her birthday gifts, I don't have a cake, I don't have anything. <laughs> so today we have to really get everything. Oh, Henley, girl. Are you, uh, well, how did your belly get so black? Um, Was that mommy's lipstick? No. You put lipstick on your belly? No. You did? No. No. No is her new favorite word. I'm not too thrilled about it. But she doesn't even always use it correctly. She just loves to tell me no. It's not a good thing. But yeah, I don't have anything at all for Zoe's birthday party. Today we need to get decorations, we need to get cake, we need to get food, we need to get balloons, we need to get her birthday gift, everything. So today's gonna be a pretty busy day, probably. On top of that, Lilia has a doctor's appointment after school, so I have to factor that into the whole day. And she's going with her dad for the weekend, so he's picking her up this evening. So, it's gonna be crazy. Hopefully I can wrap my head around vlogging and getting all this stuff done at the same time. Trey currently has Zoe with him at the office and Lily is at school, so it's just me and Henley right now at the house. And there's probably a lot of things that I should be doing, but she's pretty much taking up all of my attention this morning. Where are you going? I just got done telling you that if you're not wearing your socks and shoes, you can't go swing, right? Can we get socks and shoes? Well, you can't swim unless you're wearing a swimsuit. And I don't want to do that because it's really hot out here. So I am almost 36 weeks pregnant. I think in like two days I'll be 36 weeks pregnant. And I mentioned the other day that I am getting just like really overheated really, really easily. Inside, outside, doesn't matter. Like I just get overheated and I get like heat exhaustion, it feels like. And that happens like all the time. And of course, it is almost June in South Texas and I am pregnant. It's not gonna get any better from here. Baby, I'm going inside, okay? Baby, I cannot, I can't, I can't swing today. I'm so sorry. If you can wait for daddy to get home, I bet daddy will swing with you, or we can go out in the evening, but mommy is just too hot, okay? I feel so bad, I feel so bad. I want to play outside with her so bad, but I like, I know that I can't and it's just too much. Like, it's just too hot. It's way too hot. It's too exhausting. Okay, I, I made pictures and um, they're really good. I want to show you all of them. Yeah, I really want to show you guys Lilia's little art journal that she's been working on today. It's really cool. This is an eagle. You can clearly see the wings on the head. So cool. What's that? Mm. Oh, um, sushi. What's sushi? Sushi. Too. Oh, sushi. This is a cat. This is a a card on my banana. It says, "I love mom," and then there's a banana, and that's the thing that keeps it in. And you can read it up there. 
This is a bouquet of flowers. That's the handle, and those are all the flowers. And then this is one of my favorites. I made an owl. Head, beak, body, and that's the branch it's on, and you can read it, it says owl over there. And then duck in lake. Looks kind of like a crazy duck. Mr. Cardinal, it's a friend of mine. Um, here he is, I drew him in my journal. This one's Crazy Bird. You can clearly see that this guy is cool, cool, crazy. And this is Crying Dino. It's one, it's my favorite of them all, Crying Dino. Crying Dino in dress, cause he's cute, that's the dress. And then the last one, the last one is Kite in the Sky. Mom, ha you, ha you haven't seen Kite in the Sky yet, have you? No, I haven't. That's really cool. I love it. All right, guys, I really wanted to share that with the vlog today because Lily is about to leave us for the weekend. But are you coming to Zoe's birthday party tomorrow? Yeah, Zoe's birthday party is tomorrow, so Lilio should be there. So we'll still get to see her. I'll wash it, baby. I promise. I promise, okay? Zoe really wants me to wash her sheep. Lamb. Oh, it's a lamb now? She keeps changing it. It's always been a lamby, and then I came home and she decided it was a sheep, and then now she's deciding it's a lamb again? I don't know. Anyways guys, right now we're just waiting for Lilia to get picked up and then we're gonna head out to go and get all the stuff that we need for Zoe's birthday party. And we have Mommy, I everything to, plan to get. My birthday. You're right, I do. I need to plan a lot better. Alright guys, we finally made it to Target and we are gonna get some stuff for this birthday party. I'm gonna try to keep it to a minimum. I don't want to have a bunch of stuff to set up for this party. I don't wanna have to have a bunch of stuff to do. I just wanted I just want to vlog without my husband farting in the background me too oh that smells too anyways guys let's go in here and see what we can find to Party City for some balloons, hopefully. I'm honestly so stressed out right now. I'm trying not to be, and I'm trying to like make this as stress-free as possible. I'm trying to make it super simple, easy, with like not a lot of work, but I'm just feeling like super overwhelmed, and I don't like setting up a birthday party last minute the night before with no list. And I don't think I've even talked about it on the vlog yet, but I have misplaced my day planner, which is like my life. I have everything on my planner, and I haven't been able to find it for like two weeks now. And honestly, I'm just, I'm just like really stressed out. I'm trying not to be stressed out, and I'm trying not to let it reflect on the vlog either, but I just like, I can't help it. Like, I feel, I feel like crazy right now. And it doesn't help that I have been continually having Braxton Hicks contractions all day all day like regularly and they're not painful but they're just really annoying and I'm super out of breath I'm super pregnant and I'm super stressed so yeah. you come with me okay I know you're coming with me look at that do you like that one Baby, are you excited about tomorrow? That's a yes. I don't think you even realize what's coming. All right, so we got her a little unicorn crown. We got her some balloons. And that is pretty much it besides all the food stuff. Which we still need to get. 
All right, you guys, it's many hours later. We've been home for a while, and no, we did not go grocery shopping. I couldn't do it. I feel like I'm like kind of mentally shutting down a little bit, and I think it has a lot to do with just stress and like being in pain, and I'm just like really overwhelmed. So I decided to call in the cake order. I did order the cake, and we'll pick it up tomorrow along with all the food at once and anything else that we need to get at that store. We will get it all there tomorrow morning. I just got done filling goodie bags and I was gonna show you guys everything that I put in the goodie bags, but it's like not even that much stuff and I just wanted to get it over with. I'm gonna say that I don't recommend you plan a birthday party for your child when you're 36 weeks pregnant, basically. Um, it's not fun <laughs> and this really isn't something that I want to be doing. I also feel really guilty because I usually not go all out but like I do a lot more for my kids birthday parties and with this one I am doing the bare minimum and I'm obviously not enjoying it and I do usually enjoy throwing parties and stuff like that but I'm just really not feeling this one so I kind of feel bad that like I mean, I don't know. She's gonna have fun. She's gonna love it. She's gonna love it. She's four. You're gonna <laughs> she's, love it. she's gonna see all of her friends and there's gonna be a jumpy castle and a pool and there's gonna be unicorn stuff everywhere. And she's gonna love it. I just, I feel like I'm having to lower my own expectations for this party. So anyways, guys, I'm gonna go to bed. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video.